The wait is over. AirPods Pro just announced today. Hey there, friends on YouTube. My name is Jason. This is Painfully Honest Tech. Tech so honest it hurts. Yeah. This is your first time here. Thanks for stopping by. If you've been here before, thanks so much for coming back again today. We got news. We got news today. It has long been rumored, maybe not long been rumored, but it's been rumored that maybe, maybe, maybe we're going to see some AirPods Pro. Now, are these Pro headphones? No, but they are better than the AirPods. And so that, according to Apple, means Pro, I guess. That seems to be the way that it works. But what are these AirPods Pro? When can you get them? How much do they cost? And uh, all that various good stuff. What do we know so far? Right now, we know that the AirPods Pro will be available on October 30th, which is a couple of days from today. <laughs> I don't know. What, what is today? What is today is the 28th. Two days from today, uh, available October 20th for $249. Now, I, oh, people are just, their minds are exploding. I know it's $249, a lot of money, but let's, let's talk about that later. What are they going to be? They are going to be active noise-canceling earbuds. Now, this is a relatively new thing. Sony has something out on the market that does this. Active noise cancellation is usually when, you know, there's an array of microphones on the headphones that will then sort of listen to the sounds on the outside and then cancel those sounds out so that you get uh, the, the isolation. Uh, passive noise cancellation, obviously, is just like the better the seal in your ears, the better the isolation is. But these are going to be active noise cancellation headphones. They are going to have microphones that will that will cut out a lot of the frequencies that are happening outside in the rest of the world. They will also have what's called a transparency mode that will activate by some kind of force touch on the AirPods themselves. Most noise canceling headphones these days offer this, but I, I don't know if it's something that's been on active noise cancellation earbuds up to this point. So basically the transparency modes that you can hear everything that's going on around you while you still hear your music. It's good for if you're in an airport or if you're walking down the street or something like that, you need to hear your flight called. You need to hear if there's a car going to come and, and run you over that kind of stuff. That's what the transparency mode is for. There are a few things about this announcement that, that give me a little bit of pause. One thing is Apple says that they have what are they, they call it an adaptive EQ that will quote unquote, automatically tune music to the shape of your ear. <laughs> now, I don't know what that means. That doesn't sound like science, but Apple says it'll work. I'm usually, I'm usually kind of dubious about this kind of stuff, but we shall see. They also are going to have flexible ear tips. I imagine they're silicone ear tips. There'll be three different sizes in the box. You can find the size that you feel most comfortable with. And in fact, Apple says the AirPods themselves will help you decide which one is giving you the better fit so that you can choose the right size ear tip for you. Now, just the fact that these have silicone ear tips is a big deal in terms of noise reduction. The AirPods that we've had for the past couple of years are not very good at passive noise reduction. In fact, some people say that's a good feature about them, but some people also say that that causes us to turn our AirPods up too much and therefore like blast our eardrums and that's not good for us either. So with a seal, you get better passive noise cancellation, which means you'll be better able to hear what's going on in the headphones. That should improve the sound quality quite a bit over the existing AirPods, even if they don't change the pods themselves. Now, I don't know if that's the case, but typically more sound isolation, more seal means better sound. In terms of in terms of specs, they say that it'll last about four and a half hours. There's 24 hours of battery capacity also in the case for them. So it's a little bit less than the typical AirPods, but then again, you're getting active noise cancellation. So that's that, that's a trade-off that I guess most people would make. They're going to be sweat and water resistant, so you can take them to the gym and completely block everybody out, which is what I prefer to do when I go to the gym. So maybe these would be perfect for me to take to the gym because I don't want I don't want any, anybody around me. Okay, so everybody who was, who was out there thinking like we're going to get your matching iPhone colors and all that kind of stuff, I guess that's not happening. We're only getting white, and they're available for pre-order now. So those are the things that you need to know right off the bat. Now, what are some of my first thoughts about what I've read here? I've gone on record many times saying that the original AirPods are like really high on the convenience scale, kind of middling on the sound quality scale. These new AirPods Pro have the chance to be a little bit better in the sound quality scale. I mean, for $259, you really want something that's nice sounding, but $259 is not a crazy price for something like active noise canceling 
earbuds. Uh, Sony has their, uh, what is it, 1000 MX3s that are on the market for 229 Those are supposed to be really good. As I said, link down in the description below if you want to check those out. As I discussed, the sealed fit with the ear tips is going to help with sound quite a bit. I would really love to see Apple knock it out of the park in terms of sound quality here. I don't know that I'm going to hold my breath for that to happen, but I'm going to pre-order these and see if I can get them in my hands in a couple of days so that I can, I can tell you what I think of them in person. But for now, all we know is that we've got brand new AirPods Pro coming in white. They cost $250 and they'll be available in two days. So news flash over. Anyway, let me know what you think about the AirPods Pro down in the comments below. I'm really looking forward to hearing what you guys have to say. Are you going to buy some? Is $250 too much for you? Is it just right? Uh, do you have other noise canceling headphones that you prefer or that you are going to buy or that you have already bought? Let me know down in the comments below. Once again, thank you so much for being here. If this was your first time and you want to come on back again, then like, subscribe, mail, notify yourself, all those kinds of things. And if you've been here before, thank you ever so much for coming back again. I have channel memberships available that you can become a part of the channel you hit that join button down below and it'll tell you all the different fun things that you can get when you become a channel member hit that button down below join 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 do it once again my name is jason sometimes known as the jtl this is painfully honest tech tech so honest it hurts until the next time i'm out